Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Derek, and today we're going to do an updated binder reveal. Now, we did this probably maybe back in July, and we had a small amount of cards. We didn't have, have much in the binder, but now the binder is nearly full. There's only a few more slots left, and it'll be completely full. And pretty much most of it's all ultra rares. So, uh, there's also some shinies, but there's mainly ultra rares. And some amazing rares, too. So I've got all those now. So that's something I'm actually proud of. But um, before we get started, I would like to apologize for the lack of content. Uh, you may see my last video where I talked a little bit about it and what's going on in my life. And I apologize if that just came off a little, I don't know, sad, I guess. So... I'm trying to fix that. They changed my medicine over the weekend. I've been taking it now for a few days. And I can tell a major difference already after a few days going back on a higher dosage of the, my old medicine. And it, I feel a whole lot better. Um, I'm still a little bit upset because I'm, I'm working to get a job. And um, that's kind of hard to find a job right now, especially during this climate with the coronavirus. And most places only want to hire you part time. So it's, it's really hard to find any stable job right now. But um, as far as openings go, this week, most likely on Thursday or Friday, we'll be opening up a Japanese Astonishing Volt Tackle. Uh, if you don't know what that is, that is basically the Japanese equivalent to Vivid Voltage. I have opened up that before on the channel, and I like really like the set. And we're going to try to get that Rainbow Chunky Chew, something I really want to get. Um... As far as the rest of the time, um, there may not be any more openings for a while. Now, I'm going to try my best, uh, hopefully soon, to start doing the five-pack attack content, which what that is, well, two days a week, we'll be opening up five packs per video. I think how I want to start it out of those with Dollar Tree packs, just to see what happens. I've never had luck with Dollar Tree packs. But we're going to try it out and see what happens with it. Who knows? We might do good on them. Um, then we'll move on to other stuff. Um, we have Battle Styles coming out. Uh, well, the Japanese version comes out here in January. At the end of January and at the beginning of February, we have Shining Fates. So hopefully we can get some of that in. Uh, the Crobat box, the Dragon Ball box, and the ETB. So we'll be opening up a little bit of that. And I'm going to try my best to get a hold of a Crobat V box for the Shiny Star V set. So I'm going to try to get that too. Uh, a little bit down the road. But let's go ahead and take a look at the binder. I I'm pretty excited to show you guys. So let me go ahead and start the recording right now. Like that right there. Okay, so that worked. That worked. Alright, so you may see my beautiful baby Mega Charizard. He's a boss. He's a boss. All right, let's go ahead and take a look. There's going to be a little bit of a glare, and I do apologize. Um, but let's go through it. It's probably be a longer video than usual, a little bit longer. This right here, that's uh, Mewtwo. It's probably one of my favorite cards. I'm just going to say that now. It's probably one of my favorite artworks of Mewtwo. Uh, there's the Test Tube Mewtwo I really want to get, and the Armored Mewtwo I really want to get. Um, anything Mewtwo, man. Mewtwo is my favorite Pokemon. I got that full art Guzma. Guzma? 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 I don't know why I call it Guzma. Is it Guzma or Guzma? Guzma. And yeah, this Alakazam's badass. I love this Alakazam. And the uh, actual mega evolutions of the pre starters. Uh, the Snorlax. Love the Snorlax. That's one of my favorite artworks of this year. And I'm pretty excited to have that in my set. Uh, see, another Mew, Mewtwo, Mew, Mewtwo. Kind of something I like. Um, I've been playing a lot of the trading card game online. And I've been having a lot of fun with it, honestly. I I didn't think I would. And I really do like it. But that doesn't mean I'm using these guys. I, I'm, I'm not stealing your guys' codes. I'm not going to take your codes. I'm just doing everything in trading because before we started giving away codes, uh, I was actually using the codes there for a while. But the codes are mainly for you guys. They're not for me. They're for you. 
So let's keep on going through here. Oh yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is this, do we have the shiny ditto? No, it's not there yet. There's a chunky boy, my chunky chew. Big old chunk. I want that rainbow rare, man. Really do. I really do. Some hidden fates, Lycan Rock. Shiny boy. Charizard, Charizard. I, I had to keep this Charizard in here. This is the uh, hollow, Japanese hollow, and I wanted to keep that. Of course, everything Charizard. Got another Chalky Boy. Give me one second. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. I didn't realize my door was opening. We'll leave that in. We'll leave that in the video. We'll just leave it there. Who cares? All right, let's keep on going, guys. Got some more shinies, some Eternatus V Max. I didn't realize I had two Eternatus V Max. I probably have more than that, honestly. I just, I every time I go through my folder and I do it a lot, I notice new things all the time that I didn't realize I have, and it, it's kind of aggravating. There we go. Okay. Funny thing about these, these were on sale at Walmart. This was back in August, and it was a Gengar box. And it was on sale for $11. I have seen these Gengar boxes go for around $50 or $60 now. And you could get them easily. Well, I got them easily at a Walmart. And, I mean, I didn't score anything big from the packs. But, I mean, it was something. I don't even know if they had evolutions in them or anything. It's my Mega Mewtwo. My Mega Boy. <laughs> it's kind of kind of cool how you can go through these pet, like cars and kind of see... Man, I, I remember pulling that. That was a pretty awesome day. Pretty awesome pulls. And this is one of my favorite cards here. This uh, at Red and Pikachu. I love the trainer cards. I, I'd like to try to get all of them. But they're kind of hard to get, like some of them, the collection is. Some of them are expensive, too. Uh, I got this from the uh, Goblin Traders. Uh, I don't have to buy the Small but Mighty set now, just because I got that promo. now. And that's the only reason why I wanted that. Okay, let's keep going on here. And hopefully this isn't boring to you guys. I, I, I'm excited to show you one of my favorite things right now. This in Pokemon is my favorite thing ever as of right now. I, I love Pokemon. I could collect it forever and ever and ever and yeah. I, 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 I don't really sell my cards. I, I do some trades from time to time. Uh, like the other day I traded a I had a duplicate copy of some amazing rares. So Rayquaza, Raikou and Celebi and I did some trades on that and I had an extra Chonky Chew uh, Traded that and just for more packs like I love cracking packs That's one of my favorite things to do whenever I started um, Getting back into TCG games. I started off with Magic the Gathering and um, I ended up getting Tons and tons of booster boxes and I have a really addictive personality so it kind of kind of goes and this is why i'm so addicted to pokemon is because i'm just addicted to the, the crack crack it's basically crack like crack cocaine for young men children i don't know why i said it that way it's cringy hang on hang on okay that was cringy i apologize <coughs> Yeah, that was stupid. I'm not that smart, guys. Not that smart. Yeah, I actually like these energies, though. These are secret rares from, uh, I think it was Legendary Heartbeat. It's either Legendary Heartbeat or Tag Team All-Stars. I, I, I know we opened up a few of those, uh, which I'd like to open up some more Tag Team. That may be something in the future. We Maybe I can get us a couple boxes of Tag Team. And I actually really like this promo. And this brings back memories for me. I remember when, going to the movies just to get this card. 
Uh, this isn't in the best of cha shape. I need to get a better one, a nicer one. Um, but it's just nostalgic just to see it. You can't play it. It's it's just a card, but it holds a lot um, of memory, like good memories for me. It's like I just remember watching the po Pokemon movie, and I was like, yeah, Ancient Mew. I can't wait. I can't wait to get that. And I, I had dozens of them when I was a kid, but all my cards got stolen in middle school. I had a Charizard and all that stuff. And I know who did it. I know who did it. If I find you, I'm putting my boot up your ass. I, I, I carry a grudge, man. Here's our shiny Ditto. And a shiny Eldegoss. Shining Star V was such a good set to open, guys. I, I hope if... If you guys get a chance and you can get a, get a box of it, or when Shining Fates comes out, you get a box of that, open it up. Hopefully you get yourself some nice shinies. Here's the golden uh, <coughs> Eternatus VMAX. Uh, that came from Shiny Star V. And we got some other cool stuff here. Some shinies. We got the uh, Vivid Voltage Promo Lugia, which I really... Lugia is one of my favorite Pokemon. So my, my favorite Pokemon is Gengar, Mewtwo, um, Alakazam, Lugia, Cyndaquil, and Rayquaza, I think. It's it's a tie between Rayquaza and Mew. There's a, there's my uh, Rainbow Rare VMAX. And here's 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 my proud this is my proud boys. So we got the Evolution Charizard, the Darkness of Blaze Charizard. The two beautiful Charizards from, uh, what's Champion's Path? My Champion's Path. Ma Champion's Path. Yeah. And we got the Mega Charizard, the Charizard Embracing, the Charizard from Vivid Voltage. That's the, uh, promo. That was pretty cool. And I forget what set that's from. Some of these, I don't know where what sets they came from, because I'm still kind of new. These, I'm really, I'm really proud of these. And I have the other one on the back here. But I'm really proud of the amazing rares, having all of them. I, I hope they print more. I want a I want a Mew and a Mewtwo and a Charizard. Give me that shit. Like today. There's the uh Reshiram and this awesome promo we just opened up with uh, Hidden Fates, which was awesome. Hidden Fates was a really good set. I hope we can do more Hidden Fates one these days. Maybe. Here's some big boys too. We got the Blastoise V Max and the Venusaur V Max. That came from a Japanese uh, train. It was a deck set, and you got two of each of these. They had a Charizard one, but you only got one Charizard because Charizard is expensive. Speaking of Charizard, we have two of the Reverse Hollow Charizards from Vivid Voltage, which are pretty cool. I had to keep those in there. And that's the last of it. See, we only have, we have two, uh, 10, 18, 18 more cards. And we'll be finished with this book. We'll be absolutely finished. But yeah, I, I am happy you guys are still giving, you know, helping the channel grow. Uh, I'm hoping that um, the channel will keep growing. Um, and hopefully we can do a little bit better with the unboxings. I know right now it's going to be hard to do. We're, we're a small channel. We can't, obviously we can't afford to buy Pokemon cards all the time. But we're going to try to get some out. So maybe once or twice a week. Something like that. Until we start growing and getting bigger. If we get bigger. And hopefully we can continue to grow. Um, you know, I one of the things I would love to do is do a collaboration with another Pokemon um, <clears throat> Pokemon card uh, channel. That'd be amazing to get uh, Real Breaking Nate to check out the channel and stuff like that. Maybe Leon Hart. That's never going to happen unless we share and share and maybe they'll be like, oh, we should check this guy out. Oh, he's kind of fat. That was cringe. Cringe, guys. I love cringe. I, I don't know why. I don't know why I love the cringe. But, yeah, that is our binder right now. That is our ultra rare binder. We have some uh, holo rare binders. If you guys want to see those, let me know in the comments. But, feel free to hit that follow button. Hit that like button and share this channel. Help. Let's get growing here. Let's get to 500 followers. 
Once we hit 500 followers, we are doing a ETB giveaway. So you gotta hit that follow button. But until then, guys, thank you so much for hanging out. I uh, love you guys so much, and we will we'll see you soon.